Hello, my name is Tara Rutkowski, and I am your local Arizona solar agent. I am here today to talk about the difference between net metering and net billing when it comes to APS. So about a year ago, on August 31st of 2017, APS changed the game when it came to solar. We used to have what was called net metering, and net metering is essentially how you are given credit for the energy that you send back to APS when your home is producing more energy than what it needs. With net metering, when you sent the energy back to APS, they would give you a power credit. And that power credit could be used at a later date and time, whenever the home needed it, when your system was not producing as much as what it needed. However, what we have today is called net billing. And it's very different from net metering because with net billing, as soon as you send the energy back, APS buys it from you at a certain rate at that given moment in time. So you're no longer getting a retail rate for the energy that you feed back, which is what you got with net metering, but instead they buy it from you at a predetermined rate. And that rate with APS has the ability to be lowered every single year by up to 10%. For example, right now it's August 2nd of 2018. The buyback rate is 12.9 cents a kilowatt hour. However, on September 1st of 2018, the buyback rate is going to drop from 12.9 cents by 10% so it's gonna to go to 11.6 cents a kilowatt hour. Not quite the same as what people got with net metering when it was a retail rate exchange of power credits. I hope that this helps further explain a little bit the difference between net metering and net billing. If you have any questions, you're more than welcome to reach out to me at any time. My phone number is 623-640-6546. Thanks and I hope you have a great day.